Mm. I mean, I've never, ever heard a singer since then. And I've been to many shows, and I backed up many artists on drums. Mm. She, she was one in a million. Yeah. Five octave range. Um, she was, uh, yeah. I remember self-control. I remember... Uh, um, how am I supposed to live without you? And of course, Gloria, which was her real mainstream song, right? And Umberto Tosi, the Italian tune, and mm -hmm. they, they redid that. But it was a girl about in the fast lane. And that achieved her fame and stardom. What uh, was that one again? Give, give me a few bars of that. Can you possibly? Cause that, <laughs> no, but what, 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 to give me an idea. You don't have to sing it. What was the idea of that? You don't have to, don't have to say it. I don't want to put you on the spot. Well, only Laura could speak for Laura. And I remember so. that. and I'm, It's just. It's on a few interviews. Um, vaguely. You know, back then, when, when I dated her and, and the band, there was no YouTube. There was no, no YouTube. Media. Nothing. I found all this out. Yeah. After the fact. Yes. So... You know, when we performed in Boston, which was her last show, uh -huh. and it was just us to track, it was almost like we were concerned about more about eating, what time is dinner, <laughs> the after ha hangout, yeah. um, meeting Kathy and Vince Golok at, at the lounge for drinks. Uh, and uh, it, like I said, there was no social media at the time. So that yeah. kind of helped in our relationship because of I, course. Didn't, I didn't see her as Laura Brannigan, the world star. Yeah. I saw her Laura Brannigan... As the person, uh, yes, the love, the cooking, the uh, East Quad, wonderful cook. Out. Oh my gosh, amazing! She loved Greek food, and you know, every time I go to the thing, right up your alley, <laughs> <laughs> of course. Okay. 